Hello guys, welcome to feeding.net. So in this particular session, we are going to learn about how to create the PDF document in C sharp. So without wasting time, let's start the session. So guys, uh, I have already created some dummy code to create the PDF in C sharp. Let me explain you. So for this demo, I have used the iText sharp uh, package from NuGet. Uh, what you can do, you can go to uh, manage NuGet uh, packages and there you can search iTextSharp. Okay, and here once you click it, then you, you need to install it. So that I have uh, used to create the PDF and here if we looked into the code. Okay, so iTextSharp is basically a popular library for creating and manipulating PDF. You can create a PDF file with a single document or you can append as many pages as you want. And using a proper HTML, using you can give the design using HTML as well. But for this demo, I kept it uh, pretty simple. So see, so iTextSharp uh, library gives a class called a document class so it basically represent one pdf uh, document so at the start i created the instance of document object then uh, i mean uh, using this uh, using operator i have created the instance of class file stream so that when it is not in use the memory is uh, will be disposed and it is automatically handled by garbage collector so it's a, a pretty good norm to use using Okay, here I have created file stream object there you need to provide the path and you need to provide the mode uh, for the file creation since I am creating the new PDF I provided the mode as create so in next line I have created an object of PDF writer again this class is exposed by itext sharp library only here I call it one of the method called get instance there i pass the document that i have created our document object and here i pass the file stream file stream is basically uh, it has a file path and it's basically has the mode now i have opened the document you sh when you want to write something in your document at first you need to open the document so here i did the same i opened the document then i use it's one of the method called add and there I am creating an object of, of uh, a paragraph and I am passing the text which I want to write. So uh, at the page one of PDF document, this will be uh, written hello page one. So if you want to create a customized uh, PDF design or something, so there you can use all those HTML tags, make it dynamic or provide any static content. It will come whatever you provide in this tag now what i have did i wanted to have a page two in my document so this is page one and now i called a method called new page and then again i have added a separate page that is page two hello first page two and then i closed my document uh, object by calling the uh, close method okay it means that the content has been written in the body you can now safely close the body now if you want to catch any exception uh, that is provided by their uh, library you can use the document exception uh, method in the cache now let me run it so i give the part c drive file and i give the file name as example triple two let's run this program uh, just wait so uh, now let's go to the part path and see if the file is getting created or not so this is the folder and this is the pdf so when I open it, I can see on page one, hello page one and on page two, hello page two. So I hope uh, guys, everything is clear to you. If something you have any query, you can just ping me in the comment section. If you like it, uh, then please do like my video.